Hey guys, so in this video, we are going to discuss how to record business expenses that were paid out of owner's personal account. It could be credit card or bank account and how to record it in QuickBooks Online. So first of all, I do not recommend commingling personal and business funds at all. Um, one should keep their business and personal expenses totally separate. Business expenses should strictly be paid out of business bank or credit card account and personal again should be kept totally separate but there are a lot of people who still do this sometimes they don't have a bank account set up yet so they have to use their personal ac uh, account um in other instances they just they end up using their personal card or bank account for business expenses anyhow but before we get into how to record the actual entry we need to understand why we do it why we need to record it in books we need to record it in the books because even though business expenses were paid out of personal account, um, they are still your business expenses. And the way we're going to record it in QuickBooks is as if the owner put the money into the business and then spent the money out of the business. Uh, accounting behind the scenes is going to be the same as if owner is putting money into the business and creating equity or making contribution in the business and then spending the money and giving business the deductions for those expenses. So let's do the actual entry now. So first click on new, then journal entry. Pick the date. Pick the date. And Let's say we spent money on office supplies. We don't have this account created yet, so we are going to create this account on the fly. This is an expense. Office supplies, save and close. Let's say we spent $100 on office supplies. Business expenses. This could be from Staples, let's say. We are going to add Staples as a vendor. Okay. Let's see, the other one is advertising. It's $500. Pay to PLAS. And you can create uh, different line items, uh, different categories here for different type of expenses. So if you have other type of expenses here, let's say you had cost of goods sold for $200. Copy and paste the same memo. And you would put the vendor name here. Actually, we have to pick a vendor name here. And we will pick the equity account here. Uh, we don't have the equity account created yet. We will create it right now. Owner's equity. It's an equity type account. Equity, save and close. You can put owner's name here. I'll put my, my, my name here and vendor save. Okay, so this is as if a business owner is putting the money into the business and creating equity and then spending that money and giving business deductions. So this is how you would do an entry to record business expenses paid out of personal account. Save and close and done.